Hi, I'm Deanne Rose from Jean Vernon School and I teach year 5 to 6 students. I have 28 students in my class and this is something we did when we were doing procedural writing last term. Uh, last term we were learning about sustainability, so we are studying about trees and we went to an Arbor Day planting where we planted I think it was 700 trees and when we got back we decided to do a sequence map. So I introduced the children to the words they needed to use. It was important to have the key words because it gave the children an idea of what I was expecting of them and it helped them with their writing to put the things into order. When we did the writing, first of all I gave the children the rubric and we went through that. Then I gave them the template for what they would be using and then I gave them one coloured strip of paper and told them on that that they had to write what they did. So that was the how to plant a tree. And so they started off using the keywords and just doing a basic sequence. And once they'd done that, I gave them the surprise of a second piece of paper, which I told them was going to be the why column. Then they had to match up the how column with the why column, directly relating the why with the steps that they had followed. After they'd done that and I checked it, they then put it into a sort of report essay, like a formal procedural writing piece, which I found to be of much better quality after only a short period, just because they had all of the plan there and it was something that was fresh and something they knew a lot about. Then after they'd written their report, they came out and evaluated their own learning outcome and they used the rubrics to help them mark against it. They did really well. I found that by giving the children the key words to use, it helped their writing a lot and improved the quality that we came out with. It also made it easier for them when they were marking on the solo rubric to see where they were.